Hey, this is Rick with Shooter1721. We thought we'd just get started right out of the gate. You see, we got uh, the FX Panthera Hunter Compact 22 cal. Of course, you saw I worked a lot with the 30 cal. I took it to Pyramid Air Cup, did really well with that, got into the finals. Well, now that the 30 cal has a 395 millimeter barrel. This has a 300 millimeter barrel, weighs about six and a half pounds, and uh, we're going to shoot. We got some new stuff for you. We see we've got the trigger cam here, so that way you can see what I'm shooting, where I'm shooting, and right there, if you take a look, we got, and then we got the new uh, ballistics, um, chronograph true ballistics from uh, FX. We got that also. So there's 50 yards, and then there's there's a Pennsylvania grizzly bear, which we'll focus in at 100 yards. But that way you can watch what I'm doing uh, all right here at the table. You see what we're doing. Scope cam doesn't lie. Everything's right here, and you can watch in real time. And uh, we're going to show you how this shoots in uh, with 18 grain JSBs right there. That's my favorite pellet, always has been for the 22. And uh, we're going to shoot some of those at 50 and then 100 and then uh, talk about this gun because this gun is absolutely awesome. All right. Let's see what we got. We got a little bit of wind play. We can look at our wind flag down there. All right. Let's get settled in here. I'll aim center mass and see what the wind does. It's showing a, a right to left. I don't know if everybody saw that, but that was three shots in this. When I say same hole, same hole. That wind picked up just a hair on that. You can see that wind flag moving. And you can see the perfection of this thing. With a 300 millimeter barrel, 50 yards, 892 feet per second. What more do you want? Now we're going to move out there and we got to see if we got our wind flags, what's happening out at 100. We can feel it right now in our face. You can see the leaves coming off the tree on there. You can see them coming to the ground, which way they're going. All right, I'm going to move out to 100 yards. And we're going to go on the PA grizzly bear there. All right, let's see what we get here. Um, how's that for focus, Ryan? Are we good or... I'm going to go for headshots. I'm just going to hold right in there. A little high. That is a little high. I guessed a little bit off. I'm going to come down. Do you see them two are on top of each other? That's incredible. That's that's three shots. It looks like one here. Oh, that's awful. Can we see that? Do you see that okay? Well, this is, remember when, Ryan, when I said I had to make an adjustment. So that's the first shot right here, okay? And that's where I hit, then I made the adjustment. And I basically, see this flake here? I basically went with this. That is three shots at 100 yards, 18 grain JSB. There's a little bit of air. But when you can take your pinky and put it right there, that's, that's insane. For a compact at 100 yards, we, the reason we're down here doing the videos because we don't feel like the scope cam was quite clear enough. You can see that there was only one dot on there, but I wanted it clear so you really got a good understanding. Remember, I was like, oh, I'm high. And then I just readjusted and held here. That's amazing. Incredible gun. Wow. That's absolutely perfect at 100. 
Wow. Wow. Well, I'm I, I'm not even going to shoot any more shots. I, when I say it's perfect, well, it's, it's perfect. It's perfect at a hundred, but you could try and shoot something a little bit farther than that. Just kind of. Okay. Just legs. Look at okay. the numbers there. You should be able to shoot 200, no problem. So I took the liberty of setting up a target. Where? It's at 200. You'll what? This is a compact. That's 200 yards. Shouldn't be a problem. <laughs> Where is uh, that? 68 at 100 yards, so 200 yards. Yeah, you'll be fine. Oh, is that can right there. Hang on, hang on. I want to I show everybody. Oh, shoot. Paint left over. That guy right there. That's it. All right, so that is 200 at 900 feet a second. MRAD. You know what you're doing there? No. <laughs> I actually... I'm actually... Uh... Eight... I think so. I think I got this zeroed now. I'm going to take a shot. I, I'm going to hold four. I dialed. I don't know how much I got in there, but I'll take a shot and see where we're Boy. All right. Let's see. All right. Send it. I'm going to hold just on the left edge. Uh -huh. Ooh. We hit something. Oh, we hit something. We hit a little low, so that means I'm going to come up. Can you still see? Ooh, it's just it's hanging out right there. All right. We'll go with it. Oh, saw that. Okay, I'm going to give a little bit of adjustment. Okay. Oh, boy. All right. You were close on that. 200 yards. 18 grain JSB. Oh, I saw it. We're going to give her a little more. Okay. I'm going to hold left this time. Probably hit low, but let's see if we get him. <laughs> there we go. There it is. Took me a couple shots. That was pretty cool. Well, not bad real world. I mean, you just kind of dialed it and like Yeah. It wasn't Yeah. Yeah, that was that was actually impressive. 887 and that's a 300 shooting an 18 green pellet. And we did a little bit of dialing. I I mean, I guess if I ran some stray lock on it, I could get this all dialed in, but Man, to see a 300 millimeter Hunter Compact shoot 200 yards in a couple of shots, that might be, that spray paint can's like a prairie dog, if you think about it. Yeah. So that's a, a hike out there. Yeah. yeah. All right. Let's see what else we got going on. That's crazy. Okay, here we are at the end of the video, and this, this is the perfect Hunter Compact, 100%. Uh, like I said earlier in the video, I shot the 30 in competition at the Pyramid Air Cup, getting into the finals with a compact. The accuracy of the compact is ridiculous. And as you saw in this video at 100 yards, that was crazy good. And then even the challenge shot that Ryan had at 200. And yeah, and to me, <laughs> this is becoming a new favorite. I love the impact. I love the crown. Uh, but this gun right here, um, I think in, for me, I would have in my, in my gun room, I would definitely have all three of these. I don't know if they make a 177, I'd say all four, but I'd love to have the 30, the 25, the 22, and 177. This platform here, the way it's set up and the accuracy of it, so far, in the two guns we've tested is just absolutely amazing. And you see I'm running the element here, HDLR on here, the 2 to 16. Perfect. Done deal. Love the scope on this gun. There's no doubt about it. And the gun coming in at six and a half pounds. And you see I got the 300 bottle. But maybe maybe we want to do, there's, there's a 400 look. There's what a 400 would look on there. And then I even brought the 580 just to see what the 580 would look like. And, and the 580 is still looking, looks like we'd be, let's go right there. Yeah, we could even put a 580 on there. And then, of course, you got, if you want more air, you can throw a 300, just get the adapter for the back there. But you talk about, in 22 cal, the perfect bird and squirrel gun with pellets. This thing's amazing. I didn't get the slugs yet, but that's another video. This is Rick with Shooter1721.
Thanks for watching.